good morning. We are at school. We just finished up eating breakfast. Okay. And I'm working on my holiday party letter, and there's the bell. So I will be having kids very shortly. Uh, I'll catch back up with y'all probably at lunch. Have a good day, Pace. Uh. my children off at lunch and now I'm back in the room to get stuff ready for our science lesson today since we're gonna be making butter it's been a pretty good morning so far my kids have been a little chatty but this morning we worked on our lit rotations I did some progress monitoring I'm almost caught up with my blues and greens for the whole month of or for the whole yeah for uh, I had to do them one time in October and one time in November and December so I'm almost done with those. And they worked on their Scholastic News this morning. We went in the auditorium and practiced our songs for our program. And then we came back and read a chapter in Junie B. Jones. So I am going to go get the heavy whipping cream and some crackers and salt for our making butter experiment and eat some lunch. So we have had a busy day, but it's been a good day. But I will catch back up with you guys in a little while. Long ago, people had to make their own butter. Today, if we need butter, butter, we can buy it from wait, the store. We can buy it from the store. If we Don't need, tell me. Do you know how to spell store? Butter. S T O R E. Yes. I know how to spell butter. O R E. How can S T O R E? Check. Oh, that is hard. No, it ain't. Kinda. Once you get tired. This cracker is good. Yeah. Is it getting thicker? Is it getting thicker? It's going to get harder to shake the thicker it gets. I'm ready to shake it. Good shaking. Two-fourths yellow, two-fourths orange. Good. Done. Yay. Can I go sharpen my yellow pencil? Yes. Okay. Two-thirds blue. One. Oh. What should that be? Thirds. Yeah, change that to thirds. Good. Oh, yours looks nice. Let's see. One half green, one half brown. Two-thirds black. One half. That shouldn't be half. These aren't halves. What are these? Oops, I missed that. What should it be? Oh, no. One. Bingo. One fourth. Yes. Okay. Two fourth red. Two fourth blue. Purple. Oh, purple. Okay. And now the last one. You must like red and blue. He does. Two thirds. <laughs> two thirds what? Of blue. You didn't write the color. Two third blue and one third red. red. Miss Edwards, do you think black will look good with this color? Sure. Well, I made it through the day. It is 
is 3 15 and I am sitting here working on my holiday letter and Secret Santa exchange note that I'm sending home Monday when we come back from break. Um, I've got, I feel like I've got lots to do and I'm not in really any big hurry because I don't have Paisley this evening. She is going over to her dad's house and then I think I'm going to go visit my parents and so I'm not on any, you know, big rush to get out of here today. So I'm going to try to work on this holiday letter so I can get that ready to send home. Work on my plans for the week after we come back. And I've got some papers I need to grade too. I'll be here for a little while working. This afternoon went pretty well. My kids did fraction flags, which they're getting better at. Today we did more than one part of a flag the same color. So like, for example, this flag has two parts green, which is two fourths green, one fourth pink and one fourth blue. So we talked about how it has four equal parts. They're called fourths. And then we wrote over here the fractions for the colors. And we did that a couple of times. And we, then we referred back to our other poster. They worked on those, and I feel pretty good uh, for the most part. Some of them are still struggling, but those are in my green basket ready to check. So I will be taking those home. I try to walk around and check while they're working, just so it's less work for me later. But that doesn't always happen with every single child. So I have ones to check in there. As a second grade team, we are doing a program for our parents coming up the second, no, the first full week of December. And so when we get back, we're gonna be teaching students during our science time and social studies time about different holidays and Christmases around the world. So I was planning on doing Russia, but I cannot find anything really that has to do, like a poem, like a poem that they can read about the Russian tradition. Um, I found facts, but Nothing's really that kid friendly. So I think I'm going to change and do Sweden because one of my team teachers sent us some Christmas around the world passages that she found. But I'm going to go through there and see if I can find something for that. We're also going to do a craft and a kind of food from that country. And then we'll rotate the kids to each classroom. They'll go to one different classroom a day during our content time and learn about that culture and that tradition for Christmas. So I got to work on that. I'm working on my holiday letter here. I'm using Canva to create it. But this is what I have so far. We're doing a holiday party and a secret Santa. And then on the second sheet, I'm going to do like the, where the parents check yes or no that they can bring candy for treat bags or um, do the secret Santa. I'll be working on this for a little while. If you can believe this, I am still at school, and it is 5.30. <laughs> um, my friend came in here that also teaches second grade with me, and we sat down, and we're talking about we're doing Christmas around the world next week when we get back for two weeks, and then our program is that. So we were coming up with how we're going to have our kids do a passport. We're going to make these little travel bags that they're going to take from room to room, so it just took some time. But I've got my writing folders here. I'm going to take those home. I've got my bag slam packed because I have so much stuff to take home and do. Uh, my room is pretty clean. Morning work's laid out. I have some stuff over here for next week. I finished my holiday party and Secret Santa letter. And then I'm going to staple this sheet to the back where they can check yes or no for the Secret Santa and then yes or no for the bag of candy. So I got that done, and all that's going home Monday. So I'm going to jump off here and head home, I guess. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see more videos from me. Since today is the last day this week, I'm going to try to do a tag video and maybe some other classroom management videos. So be on the lookout for those, and I will see you guys very soon.